While people are on vacation enjoying what the outdoors has to offer, North Carolina wildlife officers were patrolling waters and roadways, making sure everyone is staying safe. Digital reporter Victoria Holmes spoke to one officer and gives us a recap of summer incidents. Although it's the end of summer, many wildlife activities are just getting started. The good news is wildlife officers say there has been a decrease in boating incidents compared to previous years and hope to see those numbers stay down as we enter the fall season. There are 29 boating fatalities last year. For this year, while an official number has not been released, officers say they've seen less incidents in eastern North Carolina. They encourage people to always wear their life jackets while out on the water. That's because most fatalities in 2020 were caused by drowning. North Carolina Wildlife Officer Ryan Biggerstaff says people stay safe by asking questions, knowing state laws, and of course with teamwork. You know, I challenge everyone that's, you know, experienced in hunting, fishing, boating, or trapping, find someone and mentor them get them out. The Wildlife Resources Commission wants to share their online tools like interactive maps and licensing questions to keep people informed on the latest updates. I have more information on how you can stay safe while being outdoors this fall. Visit WNCT.com and click the online originals tab. In Greenville, Victoria Holmes, 9 on your side.